Hello friends. This video is brought to you by MyWayTeaching.com. Let us start by solving an example. Please read the question on the slide. Question says that find compound interest on Rs. 12,600 for 2 years at 10% per annum compounded annually. So, in the question we are given principal equal to Rs. 12,600. Rate of interest is given as 10% and the time is given as 2 years. We know that formula for the amount if the interest is compounded annually is P into 1 plus R by 100 whole power n. Let's substitute the values. It comes out to be 12,600 1 plus 10 by 100 whole power 2. Let's solve it which is equal to 2. Let's solve it further. It comes out to be 12,600. Now take the LCM. Then this becomes 10 plus 1 whole square. And it amounts to rupees 12,600 multiplied by 11 by 10 whole square, which is rupees 12,600 multiplied by 11 by 10 multiplied by 11 by 10. Since it's a square, now let's solve it. On solving it, we get rupees fifteen thousand two hundred forty six. Now, this is the amount that has to be paid back, but we are asked to, to calculate compound interest. So, to calculate compound interest, what we need to do is from this amount which includes the interest. We should subtract the principal amount. Uh, 12,600 was the principal amount that was borrowed. And this figure will give us the compound interest. So compound interest would be amount minus principal which would be rupees 15,246 minus rupees 12,600 and it comes out to be rupees 2,646 so the compound interest is rupees 2,646 Let us read the question on the slide. It says that what amount is to be repaid on a loan of rupees 12,000 for one and a half year at 10% per annum compounded half yearly. So now we have an example based on rate of interest compounded half yearly. Let's use our knowledge we are given that principal is equal to rupees 12,000 time n is one and a half years 
but since compounding has to be done three times so we will take n is equal to 3 note that we are given that rate of interest is 10% per annum compounded half yearly and there are three half years in one and a half year that is why we are taking n is equal to 3 now remember that if rate of interest is compounded half yearly then we have to divide the rate by 2 it is given that rate of interest rate of interest is equal to 10 percent per annum compounded half yearly So actually the rate we, that we will take would be 10 divided by 2 that is equal to 5%. Now we will substitute the values in the formula. We know that formula for the amount if the interest is a compound interest is amount is equal to principal into 1 plus r by 100 whole power n let us substitute the values and find the amount so rupees 12,000 1 plus 5 by 100 whole cube let's solve it comes out to be this 12,000 multiply by 21 by 20 on taking LCM and solving we will get 21 by 20 let's solve it further The amount that the person has to pay would be 13,891.50 pesos.